Need a last minute profound Christmas gift for someone you love? How about Secrets of Birthdays, the Love and Lust Report? Right now, for one week only, you can get two reports for $52. Two for $52. That's almost $18 off the normal price. That's two great gifts for just $52 at SecretsOfBirthdays.com. Hello, Your Honor, and welcome now to Tuesday. Cloudy, pensive, a little over detached today for the judge and juries of the Zodiac. We're still processing that lunar eclipse in Gemini. That continues the first half of the day, putting a little bit of an emotional twist or spin or shadow on your beliefs or your wisdom and your knowledge, that all of the above. So you might be questioning what you know. You might still fall into that trap. And the sun in Sagittarius at 29 degrees. Now, 29 degrees is the final and testing degree, all right? This is a degree where we are uncertain, we start to second guess, we have the devil tempt us back. So you might get tempted into old thinking, old attitude, old dialogue, old conversations, old fights with people. Don't go there, Libra. Hold your space. Remember what you have learned. Now, that doesn't mean you're not going to question and continue to learn. Mercury retrograde in Sagittarius says that Librans will still re-question attitude uh, and their word choices and their communication styles for several weeks until Mercury catches back up to the sun. However, your whole life will not be about mind games starting tomorrow. So hold space for what you have learned so far and question what is reasonable. Now, in the second half of the day, you might get thrown into the fire at work. The moon moves into cancer, shifting your emotions more on career and legacy. And that's probably where you want to stay, frankly. I would say, considering you're an air sign, let your emotions take over the second half of the day. Let yourself get pulled into your work. It might be a nice retreat from the mind games. And it's Tuesday, we've got an episode of Just Ask Us with Lauren Serafan and Angelo Arrows. Today, a soul gardener writes in who's having a lot of issues with her three sister-in-laws. See what Angelo's clairvoyance has to say about what's really going on and Laura Serafan's advice on how to get out of it. Our dynamic duo are live everywhere, Soul Garden Streams. All right, that wraps up Tuesday. Tomorrow, we start Capricorn. Until then, live, love, be. Soul.